Ladies and gentlemen, the first man to build 21 inch biceps, drug free. My friends, I want you to, I have an honor today. My good friend Jim brought his friend Kevin to me, well, you know I make the videos, I've been making them here for God knows when. And uh, I was like, when I opened the door, I didn't expect it to look so good now. You know, let me just wear it back a little bit here, you know. And I said, I slammed the door in his face and played around. I said, Jesus, because I didn't expect it to look so well. And, you know, Jim and I were like, uh, we're the same age, and uh, I can relate to Jim like, uh, no matter how smart, you are, oh, how intelligent you are, experience is time. You can't buy experience. It's time you grow and you mature and you learn. And that takes time. And Jim, of course, has a time and the life expectancy he's behind. He, now, you know what thrills me with him? He, uh, Jim, you're trying Kevin. You know what? Um, inspired me with Jim is that Jim is still at it. And you know what? I, uh, when I first got hurt, I thought it was the end of my life. Because I was so into bodybuilding, I would have drank horse urine if they said it made muscle. But you see, I got hurt just before the steroid rage started. And I start seeing these guys looking freaky. And I said, they're doing something other than living weights. You know, and that was that beginning of Diana Ball stuff. And then, of course, it proliferated in the days. I outraged the stick of juice in their arms and all that. outrageous today. But the point I was so impressed to see Kevin and his body and the accomplishment he has made in his training, and yet in his training, he's learning. He's been in training for over 10 years, but he's still in the learning process processing, putting together, applying, very important, understanding and applying. You gotta, and once you apply and you start getting a reaction from your application, then you realize what you're doing right. And then you look, whatever you do, you say, why am I doing it? What is it doing for me? Now, Kevin, give me a devil. Jesus, get me out of here. Let me out of here. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. See, you know, when I see, now see, what I enjoy about him and his body is human. These guys take so much stuff and so much juice, they look freaky. You can't relate. So I can't relate to these new guys today because they're too freaky. They're doing anything they can do to look better. Not, and you know the tragedy with it, my friends. I sit back and I say, not one of the guys that I grew up with before, after me are still alive. They don't even make it. They burn out early because they destroy their bodies with the drugs. The only reason Jim is talking to me now, because he didn't do that. All of the guys, Steve Reese, all the guys I knew, I mean, and talked to, and trained with them all, all get the most important thing happens their heart score. It's not worth it. But I'm sitting here excited because I see somebody that I that I can be, I can be there. I see his body. It's human. It's it, it's huge. It's round, but it's not freaky. And you can get very very good without looking freaky. But that's the the, the vogue today. I hope uh, Kevin can stay out of that vogue. I can guarantee it. But. Uh, if he looks like this, he looks, I mean, when he picked that, I love that devil. <laughs> Give me another devil. <laughs> look at that, look beautiful. Can't beat him with a stick, <laughs> you know. But I, I'm glad that uh, Jim brought Kevin by because I am quite excited to meet him and go over the old days because it, it, what makes me feel good about the old days is what I've learned. And I'll tell you something. I say and I brag about it. Nobody tell me anything about bodybuilding. Nobody. I mean, I'm the oldest guy on YouTube.
give me information on body blows. First guy to build a 21 inch arm without steroids. That was considered impossible in my day. AK was considered woo! And without steroids. And the only reason I didn't use the steroids, my friends, I'm not going to sit there and tell you I didn't use the steroids because I was moral. I didn't use them because it didn't do me any good. I couldn't compete anymore. So who says I'm going to take these steroids and I didn't know it could kill you like it does. But who's the sense to be taking it and disrupting my body for nothing? You see what I'm saying? So what I want to, what I want to, what I'm saying to you right now is how happy I am that uh, Jim brought uh, Kevin in and for us to talk. And we only talk lightly. And I'm going to just close this now. And I want us, Kevin to talk a little to you. My friends, you know where to go. LeroyCobra.com and also to be continued. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Before you click away, I want you to subscribe, like, comment, hell, even dislike if you want to. At least do something before you get out of here.